I have a Burger King restaurant here, and we have a, a drive-through, which is kind of new for novice beers. We don't really, we we're not used to that. Moscow has a bunch, and I think Gatchenberg has two, but. Um, this is the first one in Novosibirsk, so I've been there once, and it's <laughs> it's very different. Well, it's not that different from American ones, but I don't think they really planned it well, and uh, it's just it's just doesn't it doesn't really work in terms of you know getting money to the cashier and getting your food. You have to actually get out of the car because um, the distance is too big between the car and the window. And it, you can't really turn. I don't know if, I, if I'm supposed to order yet or not. Oh, should I try it in English? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, can I order? That working out. <laughs> Say hello. Excuse me. Can I order, please? Say it again. Hello. I don't think anyone's out there right now. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Just do that. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, um, I don't speak Russian. Do you understand English? Do you understand English? Okay. Um, so can I get a Whopper with cheese? Чего вы могли проехать, я вас плохо слышу, там я вас обслуживаю. Пожалуйста. Езжай прям ровно и прям прям близко, близко, пожалуйста. Я хочу из машины выходить. Why are you driving so far? Keep go back. Okay, I don't speak um Russian. Can I can you get my order in English? Okay. Um, so, can I get a Whopper with cheese? I think that's what it's, that's what it said. Yeah, and uh, fries. With ketchup, yeah. Fries? Uh, big, is that good? Drink. So a drink, fries, and a Whopper. Uh, Pepsi. Big or small standard. Uh, yeah, medium. Okay. Okay. Should I pay? Do I pay here? Uh, yes. Okay. Do you have cash? No. no. Do you get? Do you accept card? Uh, yes, yes. Awesome. Okay. Take mine. This is so far. <laughs> We just we drove up to the next window and um, so far they believe I am American. You got one ruble as a bonus for your card. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they just okay they got my order ready. Okay. Thank you. This is on. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. Have a good day. All right, guys. So. I just got my my Burger King order <laughs> in English and 
they I don't think they would understand I mean they probably would know what a cheeseburger is but they have like a different kind which is like a Whopper which is you know Burger King type of thing but it's the same like literally it's the same thing and <laughs> this says this says Whopper but in Russian I feel like it tastes better maybe I just haven't had that for such a long time that I feel like it's it's good <laughs> I don't know I haven't been eating a lot of fast food here which is a good thing you just saw Russian drive throughs they're not with the way they're planned with the windows and the distance between like how high they they are it's really not very well planned I had to get out to pay for my order like why you know and there's really no way to get closer uh, somehow American drive throughs are just a lot better at, at that also the curb is really tall or high I guess next to it so you can't you can't possibly get closer it's really dumb I just why would you make a drive through and it's impossible for people to really enjoy it it's, you know, they still have to get out of their car also the card processing took so long did you get that it was so long it should not take that long but I'm just being picky and Americans and I'm not judging Americans or anything but when we had American guests here uh, for a language camp. Some of them were kind of um, annoying. They're not like bad annoying, but in terms of the service and like customer service that they didn't like it. And it's like, it's not better and it's not worse. It's just different, you know? It's kind of what I use when I'm in America and I'm not happy about something. That's usually what I tell myself. But yeah, it's just, you gotta be op more open-minded about, about certain things in different countries. Like when I was in Thailand, that, you know, it's a very interesting place. How much of a contrast there is. There are really rich areas there in Bangkok, for example. And then there are really, really poor areas. Like, like so poor that people don't have shoes or something. Well, they, they don't really need shoes. It's really hot in there anyway. But, you know, it's uh, it's just, and you, got, you can't just walk there like you're a king of the universe and all like, oh yeah, I'm a tourist and like, I'm cool. So I never do that in America. And I think if you're coming to Russia, you should not do that either, because that's rude. We're trying anyway. Okay guys, I, I thought I was gonna like end filming for now, but this is like breaking news right now. So I've been to so many, well, not so many fast food restaurants, but I've been to KFC, McDonald's, and I've been to Burger King. And none of those times when I ordered the soda, I would, or like iced tea, it would not be iced tea, it would just be cold tea. It wouldn't have any ice in it. And um, I'm an Americanized, as you may know, and I love ice in my drinks. And I love a lot of ice. And I love that I have a choice of putting ice when I'm in America, when in the fountain. The order that I just got at Burger King, I think, I don't know if they know Americans like ice or something or anything, but they put ice in my drink and I'm really happy about it. <laughs> Finally! Maybe they just had ice today. I don't know if you remember when I said ketchup and uh, fries. With ketchup. Yeah. And she gave me this because she was asking, do you want cheese or ketchup? And I was like, ketchup. Because no one eats, well, I don't eat my fries with ketchup. On my receipt, it also says, um, so suddenly over here, <laughs> which means cheese sauce. So. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not making fun of her English. Uh, she just probably was caught off guard because I was speaking English and you don't always have to, you know, provide service or serve an, uh, a foreigner when you're working. Although you kind of, you should expect that at, a, at a, an American chain restaurant. If you're ever coming to Russia, make sure to to be clear about what you want and just say ketchup if you want ketchup or just or say tomato ketchup <laughs> so they would understand what you're saying um, because I know a lot of you guys are not clear about what you want and then you post stuff like I went to Russia I didn't get what I want and now I'm salty and Russia customer service sucks it doesn't okay if you ask for it you get it they're not gonna be like Americans asking you like oh would you like this would you like that are you doing okay like you gotta ask for what you want be a man so yeah, uh, have a good day guys. Don't judge Russians. Every country is different. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Should I tell them that I forgot my bra? That'd be necessary. <laughs>
Tiger. Bugs are like a real problem in Russia in the summer. It's ridiculous. I'll make sure to see Mr. Lenin's body because as a Russian, that's my duty.